Waiting for me on the wharf will be my husband Jim and my two little girls Elizabeth and Violet. Waiting for me on the wharf will be two of my friends from the Navy, my mother Sharon and father Des, my wife Simone and my two daughters Ariel and Odette who are really excited to have their dad home. My wife Nicole will be waiting on the wharf along with my two daughters Mackenzie and Montana. I have my mum, dad, brother, sister, grandparents, auntie and uncle and my beautiful girlfriend Maddie. So waiting for me on the wharf back home is my wife Hayley, her parents, my mum and dad and my sister. I have my wife Yvette waiting for me on the wharf along with my three children Matilda, Jack and Hayden. I have my father Richard, my mum Tina and uh, my sister-in-law Amy and her husband Paolo. Uh, as soon as we get home, I just want to spend some quality time with my family. Uh, first thing I'll do when I get home is probably just give my family a big hug and then just tell them all the things we've done over the past four months. So the first thing I'm going to do when I get home is give my wife Hayley a big hug and then go down the pub for a Guinness and a pub feed. I'm going to settle into my chair, I'm going to watch some football and just enjoy some well-deserved downtime. Over the last four months, HMAS Ballarat's been deployed extensively throughout the region and has also conducted a number of large-scale multinational exercises with our regional partners and allies. The highlights of the deployment include our search for the Indonesian submarine Nangala, our participation in Operation Argos off the Korean Peninsula, Exercise Talisman Saber 21, and then the inaugural large-scale global exercise conducted off the Western Pacific that we recently finished. So the focus for the ship's company in the short term is spending time with families, rest, respite and recuperation. And then for the ship, we'll finalise preparations over the coming weeks before we redeploy to the region and continue to promote a secure, stable and prosperous in the Pacific region. 